I work in, in caustic, which is beeswax with natural pigment. For me, it's not about the medium, it's just paint. And it's just painting with it. Pink House Studio got its name from college. I'm originally from Ellington, Connecticut, and the ratio of cows to people is two to one. Mixed to that with Andy Warhol, I saw a retrospective of him and he had this pink cow wallpaper with yellow, and I was like, oh my gosh, this is awesome. This reminds me of home. I always knew I was gonna be an artist that was just making it. Since I do a lot of figurative work, I love to start with the eyes. The eyes are like where the soul, the body is. So if you start with those and you nail those, you know the rest of the painting is gonna come out okay. Appropriation, it's just stuff that already exists. And you can reinvent it and you can play with it. A lot of stuff are collage now. I love to see the hand and the brush strokes going into it and recreating it. I get images from magazines, from photos that I take. I like those things that already exist and it kind of has that trueness to it. So you've already seen it, you can relate to it and everything has a memory that comes up to it. And you're like, oh, I remember that. In college, my sister died in a car accident and I worked through that through my art. And then four years after that, I did a painting. And I'm like, I could use this as a crutch or I can turn it around and change it. And that day forward, I was like, I'm painting happy stuff. You know, let's make other people happy. Everybody else has their problems. Why do they need mine? And why do they need to hang it on their wall? So it was kind of like, let's just make happy stuff. It's simple, it's glamor, it's kind of what's happening now with a little bit of nostalgia to it. It's just fun and you can bring your own meaning to it.